Hello, everyone. How are you doing today? Well, it's Sunday, Sunday morning, and that means I need to review my goals for the week, tell you how it went. Uh, if you've been following this channel, you know that I break my goals now into 13 week chunks. This is week one of our third chunk, right? We started this December 1st of 2019. We change it up every 13 weeks so we can keep moving forward. Goals are important. One of the things that you will see when I talk about one rental at a time or the 75 day hard challenge for real estate investors is, you know, I'm trying to help you see what consistent effort focus has really done uh, and really moved the needle, uh, you know, going from a single house to, to more than that. And that's why I share my goals. Uh, some weeks are good. Some weeks are bad. This week one, um, Pretty much a big fat miss across the board. Lots of things going on in the world. I am not confused. Uh, maybe it's to be expected. Uh, but uh, if I was running a sales team again, I would let the sales team know that uh, this last week was uh, not up to expectations. Uh, again, I share the good and bad. So let me bring up the spreadsheet so you can get caught up to date with uh, how my week or yeah, how my week went. Again, this is week one. Uh, if you want, there's a whole playlist on goals. Uh, I do this every Sunday, most Sundays. I think, I think one out of 10 or 12 days, I do it on a Monday, but usually do it on a Sunday. So right out of the gate, uh, we have done, or I have new health goals. Uh, I'm an old man, nearly 50. So I'm trying to, instead of looking at weight or miles run, uh, you know, I'm being honest with myself. I'm trying to trying to see if I can't uh, get six pack abs or what, what passes for six pack abs for a, for an old man. Uh, so I'm working out every day, uh, 30 minutes a day. Some days it's just walking, right? You got to let the body recover, but I am doing that. Uh, so I nailed that, uh, fasting. Uh, I am doing the intermittent fast. If you want to, that was very meaningful, uh, for our first 13 weeks. I'd never done that before, but it really, I don't know, it shocked my body, really changed it up. So I'm a fan of that. Uh, I don't eat till 11 uh, a.m. And then I try to be done by seven. Did that six days last week. Uh, and then I'm trying to do 100 sit-ups or a five-minute plank hold. Now that's not five minutes in a row. I'm not there yet. Uh, but I'm trying to do that extra. Usually in the evenings, I work out in the morning. Uh, I am trying to do that uh, I actually did that six days last week, but on one of those days, I did 100 sit-ups and five-minute planks, so a total was seven. I actually missed yesterday. Uh, as for social impact of one rental at a time, it was, uh, it was a bad week. We didn't do all well. Uh, again, lots of stuff going on, but you know, we, did, we, were, uh, we had our worst, thir our worst uh, YouTube views in a while. I actually have these here so I can go back and look. Uh, let's see. I should have done this before. But so yeah, we hadn't been below 13,000 until week six of the last period. So uh, it was it was disappointing and still producing content, lots of new content, frankly, probably produce more content this week than than past weeks. Podcast listens, if you don't know, all of these YouTube videos, which is where I focus on original content, becomes a podcast on one rental at a time is the podcast. Uh, they load every Saturday. So if you'd rather listen via podcast, I believe every video over five minutes gets converted to a podcast. So that, that uh, is the one metric that did okay this week. Uh, we're shooting for 10,000. We got 11. New subscribers. This one was hugely disappointing to me. Um, less than 10 subscribers a day. I had one day we had a single subscriber uh, added, which is disappointing. Um, again, we'll see if this is a trend. I don't know if real estate is not sexy, if something has changed in how I'm doing it. Um, this one hurt. This, this uh, you know, I, four hours of content this week and, um, not getting the subscribers. Again, I know it's a vanity metric and all of that, but it's a goal of mine. Uh, I'm trying to make a difference. I'm using this to show I'm making a difference and just was horrible. Same on Instagram. Gosh, 
two new followers, I guess they're called, not subscribers, followers, in a week, I am not doing well and I need to do something different. Uh, as for the business, like many of you, there's not a lot of business, not a lot of new listings. Uh, my hope is with the good news that came from Friday, this starts to change. We'll know in a couple of weeks. Uh, but yeah, there's not a lot of listings in the MLS, the multiple listing service. Did look at a couple of deals, at least had conversations about a couple of deals last week with people in the hub, uh, but nothing meaningful. Uh, again, really, really slim pickings out there. I uh, did am spending some money on texting and cold calling. Uh, we're going to hopefully be doing some more stuff with James and Stratton uh, coming up. Adam uh, is the one doing text uh, and cold calling. So we'll see. Uh, haven't yet increased cash flow um, this, this, uh, this 13 weeks. That again is going to be pay off debt or add new units. Uh, we're not going to be raising rent likely this whole period. We do have one property in escrow to close. Uh, signs are it might close next week. Uh, we will see. And nothing, we, do, we are close. Uh, supposedly on getting a flip uh, purchase into escrow, but we'll see. I've been tracking this deal for weeks, so we'll see what's going on. Didn't spend any money last week. Uh, you know, we'll see, uh, we'll see where that goes. Need, need to enjoy life a little bit. Uh, still staying home, so we didn't really have any unique events. That is getting very tiresome and we need to get out. Now for what really changed, this is a big section. And, and perhaps this section is the one that's created my problem. I've tried to to kick off some new initiatives. Uh, maybe, it's, maybe it's too much, I don't know. Uh, but we did do four hours of content last week, four hours of original content. We're doing something every day. Frankly, we're doing multiple videos every day. I don't know, uh, maybe it's too much. Uh, we did do one interview, Positive Impact last week, just that was really good. Um, Sierra uh, did actually a couple with her. Um, we did do a small business last week, DH uh, Fitness. Uh, I did do one uh, IG stream last week, just talking to my phone on Instagram. Uh, not, I need to do more of that. It's it is it's different than than uh, than doing it here with Zoom or with um, YouTube. Uh, yeah, YouTube. Uh, we did do I did do one video on my book. Uh, I did not do a video on 75 day hard challenge. So that's on me. I was a guest on a podcast. I'm not sure when that will post, but all I can do is be a guest. So if you run a podcast or know someone I should let me know again, some disappointments here. Um, we only sold 51 books on Amazon. Uh, let's go back and look. That seems to be probably a while since it's been that actually, maybe not. I don't know. Let's see. So yeah, f oh, I guess we did only 33 books couple of times. So maybe that's not so bad, but still below my target. Uh, one that really hurts is the Amazon reviews. Uh, again, I give so much away. Uh, one of the ways you can thank me is to go back and leave a five-star review. Uh, just say great book or whatever you would like. That would mean a lot. Uh, this audiobook sales, this is probably wrong or actually, yeah, it's probably wrong. Uh, Audible hasn't updated their site since June 3rd. Uh, but I don't have know any different, so I'm just going to put that number down, and it will be artificially high next week. Uh, but again, Amazon or Audible reviews very disappointing. Zero. We had zero net Audible reviews last week, which was uh, pretty disappointing. Uh, free courses. We had six people sign up. Just last week was just a big miss for one rental at a time. Um, Again, trying to help people see what's possible. It's, it's a couple hours on Teachable. It's free. Uh, the paid course, again, this, this is the best thing I've created. Lots of people are always asking for mentoring and all of those things. It's the best thing I've created. It's $1.99. I give it freely. Uh, I actually created and do live streams now with students on Saturdays. I'm giving everything I can, but this was, uh, this was probably the biggest miss. This and the, the subscriber count on YouTube really hurt because uh, it feels like I'm not, I'm not hitting the mark. So uh, we need to see if this trend continues and then do some more self-reflection and then round it out. I actually didn't write anything. I had that idea for another book. I need to find time and carve that out. It's, this is a net new thing for me. So I have to juggle my schedule and see where I put that in. 
Uh, no t-shirt sales. Again, I like them. I work out in them. Passive income generator, cash rich, asset poor. The original, no alligators. Uh, again, if you're interested in these, they're on my website, onerentalatatime.com. And then no donations. We'll likely do do a donation near the end of this period. Uh, but we've upped that from 1,000 to 2,000. So uh, we like to give back. So in the end, that's my week. If you have ideas on what may have transpired, let me know, see if something's changed. I just think it was a bad week nationally, frankly, for the world. Uh, so that's maybe to be expected. We were out doing other things. Uh, but again, I look at these every week and I need to look myself in the mirror. And, and if I was in front of my sales team again, I would let them know I was disappointed. Uh, we, would, we would be having meetings about how do we catch up? So um, if you have ideas on what I can do to catch up, uh, how I can help with subscribers, how um, I can help with the course. So many people could benefit from focus and execution on how to learn their market. You make your money when you buy. Don't get tricked by these $1,000, $2,000, $5,000 things. It's $200 and you could learn a skill. I really think real, invest, real estate investing is kind of like a golf swing. It feels uncomfortable in the beginning, but once you do it over and over and over again, it starts to feel better. All right, so that's what I have. I'm disappointed in the week, but we move on. We try to improve. Take care.